Uh, I'm making this video because this happens to me uh, many times. Um, the blue light of death. Let me explain what that is. It's basically when you turn on your PlayStation, this light comes on. And it looks like it's gonna come on and cuts them off cuts right back off um I've been trying to figure out why this is happening uh, and I kind of know why now it's kind of my fault basically I've been um, watching Netflix when I go to sleep I leave my game on for at least, uh, well, I'll end up falling asleep. Not only that, but I'm sitting here playing Destiny for at least a few hours, and then I'm watching Netflix, and then I'm going to sleep. So that'll just keep happening. So I'm gonna tell you what you want to do if you have this problem and you can't um, obviously get it to work. What you want to do is you want to. You want to unplug the game and um, and then give it about, I don't know, at least three to four minutes. You want to unplug, you know, all the extra things you got. I'll never even take this off. This goes to my Turtle Beach. Take this out and then um, give it a moment. Now, I know that it can overheat, and they say even in the packaging not to uh, leave the PlayStation running for more than uh, three, four hours. And if you do, you risk breaking it. That's basically what it says. And uh, I know that is what it says, but I mean, come on now. If you're watching a movie or two, or in my case, if you fall asleep with it on, you're screwed because it's going to be on for 10 hours. Um, I just thought that it meant that if you're playing the game, not to leave it on for that long. So, uh, we'll, we'll plug it back in in a few minutes. Now, the thing is, is I've done countless searches on um, Google, and they give you all these instructions. There's all these different videos. Um, many different things that may work that may work may not work so what we're gonna do is we're gonna try a few of those but what I always do is unplug it and then plug it back in so what we're gonna end up doing is seeing if that works uh, we'll see if that works okay so what we're going to do now is we're going to plug you back in. Um, first it says to uh, unplug the uh, HDMI cord from the back of the, of the PlayStation, which is this cord right here. And wait, plug this in. And now, let's see if it works. Okay, now we got a white light. And now we got to plug in the HDMI in the back. It's kind of hard to do this from front <clears throat> um so we got a white light I'll we'll press the uh, controller button
Oh, we gotta hook it up. It says it on the screen. So let's plug in the USB. Let's see if this works. Restart PS4. And we got a white light. Now one thing is this this happens because like I said I've left it on watching Netflix. Uh even if I don't uh go to sleep, sometimes I'll put it in rest mode and I'll wake up and then it'll it'll do this. So this has happened multiple times. Uh, I guess guys just be careful because the PlayStation is like really um, fragile and sensitive and then you'll get this checking system storage screen after that the game will come on um, and then you can play it's at 34% Don't fucking talk about my candles because I like my room to smell good. <laughs> and then it's fixed. Now, if this doesn't work, then just leave it unplugged for like 10 minutes, plug it back in, uh, try it that way by just holding the button, uh, the power button. If it comes on regular, then you're good. If it doesn't, try it again, but then this time hold the button, and then you'll be, uh, you'll be starting off fresh. Alright, we're good to go. Hit like if you like my uh, video. Uh, leave a comment. Make sure you subscribe. Thanks.